we gotta get us. Turn left to merge onto A75 North towards Tampa. I really gotta get us something to hold this camera down because it should be sliding around always. But I'm actually pulling up to our meet. We got big meat actually. This is gonna be deep. We got hella people over there. And uh, like I said, I'm like half an hour late, so you know, usual me. I'm just gonna be showing you guys around, making a little bit of a film. So I'm gonna be doing two things at once. So excuse me if you guys don't get too much like talking footage. Might just be mostly like showing around the cars there because that's probably what you guys wanna see. You guys wanna hear me talk the whole time. You guys wanna see the cars. I need to go get some drink first. You know how we roll, we gotta get some monster. Kinda rainy outside too, so it's like perfect, it's like perfect weather. It's like not too hot because you know how Florida is, it's like 150 here every day. Hopefully you guys can hear me though, there's a lot of road noise, but there's gonna be a lot of really good photographers at the meet, so hopefully I'll take a couple pictures of our car. Who knows? I don't know if you guys saw the last video, but I actually did the spark plugs in the car. That's actually like my first like big job on the car that like involves like engine wise. So that was a that was a pretty big job. The left side was a little harder than the right side because of clearance, but uh, it wasn't too bad. A lot of people say like doing car plugs in the Subi is like really hard. Man, I think he's moving. A lot of people say doing spark plugs on a Subi is kind of hard, but not really. You just gotta like I don't know, just gotta take your time with it. The spark plugs definitely did help a lot. Like I can feel like the car idles way better. Like before when I used to turn it on, even like you used to like stutter, stutter, stutter. You used to stutter, stutter, stutter. Yeah, you used to stutter a little bit. But now it just turns on like right on like pretty much right as you turn the key. So like I said in the video, I want to go stage two, but before I can do that, I want to make sure everything's running really good on the car. What size wheels you got on here? 18s? Oh yeah, 18 by 9.5, 30. Okay. What about tires? Michelin AS3. Oh, the size? Mm -hmm. 245, 40. Don't okay. go that. Do 35s. I mean, if you want to deal with the rubbing. Oh, that's just step on gum? That's gross. <laughs> you just got to roll your fenders because I was slammed. I was barely one finger, not one finger, but I wasn't even one finger. Mm -hmm. We had to lift it up again because I was rubbing so much. So you think 265 would rub for sure, right? 265, 35 won't rub. 265, 40s would rub. Is that the Lonely Genesis? I know you guys seen this most thing before. Sheesh. The light here is a beauty, literally. Like every car looks like a diamond. I'm probably gonna get some clips of all these cars a little bit later. Right now, I'm just trying to show you guys around what cars are here. Alright, guys, so it actually started raining here. I know I didn't get too many clips because it started raining. I didn't want to have the camera out. But we're gonna go ahead up another spot. It's actually like a parking garage. So we're gonna be like, you know, undercover. So we're gonna be all good. Showed you guys that black WRX, I think it's pretty clean. It's an auto actually. I've never seen an auto WRX. Like I've heard of them, but I've never seen one like, you know, in person. So I want to see if I can get a ride in it later, show you guys around it. But uh, we got a couple really nice cars over there too. We have a lot of really nice cars out here actually. Nice SM4. I don't know if you guys saw a couple videos back, but the M4 is super clean.
makes the shots look so much better like this rainy weather this is what I love for you can get like the perfect sunshine perfect sunset shots and then you can also get like these rainy shots that are awesome is that a parking garage? Oh it up They don't know I got a sandwich ready for me and you though. <laughs> I'm always the last guy, but that's what happens when you film, so I don't even care. Yeah, you're good, you're good. <laughs> so hopefully you guys can hear the difference, but I'm actually hooked up on a lavalier mic right now. If you guys don't know what that is, it's pretty much a little mic that goes up your shirt or wherever you want. And uh, you have a transmitter that you bring with you, so I can pretty much just walk away one second. Yeah, I should be able to still hear me, like I'm close to the camera, but I'm like eight feet away, so. So I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Monday and Thursday, post new videos. Stay tuned, and just like that, I'll see y'all in the next one.